We all know that every killer in DBD has some bad add-ons, but there's one killer in particular that is painfully lacking in the add-on department, and that of course is none other than the Blight. <laughs> Could you imagine? The Executioner has been in the game for over three years now, and is easily the king of shit add-ons with the exception of the ranged ones. Like, look at this, I can't even visibly tell the difference between these. 15 second oblivious on a purple? And don't even get me started on the fucking eggs. Well, there is one add-on that seems to go overlooked, and for the first time on this channel, I'm gonna try it out. And that add-on is the Iridescent Goblet. You put your name in the Goblet of Fire. The Rites of Judgment Trail, aka Lasagna, is placed in the environment. Whenever I stand on one, I become undetectable for as long as I stay moving over the trail. Now, on paper, this seems like it could be cool and maybe even valuable if played correctly, especially becoming undetectable with an add-on instead of using a perk slot for the same result. And for all my feet lovers out there, I'm also going to be bringing the Mannequin Foot, which keeps the trails in the environment for an additional 20 seconds. Listen, guys, we're all waiting for Chucky to come out, so... Also, I'd like to give a quick shout-out to Niz, the one, and UC Leia for being awesome members of my Twitch community. And if I said your name wrong, I'm very sorry. Okay, let's go. Okay, Sheltered Woods, uh, one person on lethal, two, three, uh, maybe there's a fourth potentially on, oh, he's right here, never mind, he's got distortion. All right, so obviously with this, we're gonna try to set up some trails and be undetectable, but I don't know how great that's gonna be. We'll see, so as you can see, I'm undetectable, but as soon as I leave the area, uh, my terror radius instantly comes back. So we're gonna try to see how, how we can do this and set up at tiles and see if it makes sense. I need to smooth it down here. It'd be swell. We get these, right? Yes! Big sword. All right, Alex. All right, let's pick up immediately just in case somebody's nearby. Fuck! Okay, background player on the fun. Good to know. All right, I have an idea here. So we got some progress on this gen. Here's the plan. I'm going to give us a kick. See here with that. And then we'll set up a trail right here. And then we'll just chill. That'll work. <laughs> Okay, not so bad. I mean, it's like, it's kind of one of the things where it's like, why wouldn't you just run Insidious as some of the better add-ons? But let's see if we can, we'll see if we can do it in, a, in an actual chase. See if it would make sense. All right, down she goes. Lovely, lovely. Nice. Alrighty. I'm also running this, uh, I, I've already forgotten the name. I, I think it's called the Foot Fetish. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set up some trails and they stay a little bit longer in the environment, which is nice. Okay, here's a nurse's calling. Let's get a little bit closer. And let's go and pick up one of our trails. We're undetectable again. Nancy sees us. Just for a brief moment. All right. We still have our trail here. Nice hit on the Nancy. Nice. Bogger Town. I wish it was like one of the things where the trails would, like, you would stay undetectable. Like, it would linger for a little bit longer. You know what I'm saying? A moonwalk back into this wizard. Nice. There we go. I think this atom will work decently for like stuff like this. Maybe we'll see. Kind of just hide out here for a second. <laughs> Didn't look like it worked. All right, but hold on. All right, I'm all ears. Very nice. Oh, I don't have any range though. She has life. Yikes. All right, new progress. Here we go. Our trails are still up right here. So let's go and give that a kick. And we'll go chill right here. We'll listen for the ace. Oh, here we go. Okay, Ace is here and Funk should be right here, right? Yeah. <laughs> so, it's, you know, it's a little, it's probably a little bit confusing. You know what I'm saying? Let's try here at this tile. Oh, never mind. <laughs> okay. Let's just get her down. I'm trying to find a way to make it, like, work in an actual, like, setting that would make sense. But it's kind of one of those things where it's like, you should probably just run Insidious, right? You'd imagine. All right, here's the scoop. I'm gonna set up a trail right over here by this rock. Oh, never mind, we're just gonna doubt her. We're just gonna doubt her, never mind. You know what I think would be a cool thing we would run with this? Is we would run this with like Dragon's Grip, maybe? I can see getting some value out of that potentially. Okay, here's Ace. Now Ace does have distortion, so we gotta keep that in mind. All right, anybody home and know where to hide? Yeah, wizard right here. Love that. Love a good wizard. Oh wait, hold up. This could be cool. This could be nice. Let's let's try this out. <laughs> okay. All right, we got her. 
So this whole shack, I'm essentially undetectable? Are we getting value? Are we actually getting value out of this? Maybe so. Not undetectable. I don't know what that was about. That was a little weird. Completely undetectable here. Can we ride this over to this gen? Nice. Michaela was on it. Okay. We're making some stuff work here. Good dodge. Good dodge. Good dodge. I'm trying, like, trying to make have this make sense. All right, nice. So we have two downs here, and I got one in Shack. Okay, this is not gonna be bad. I think Michaela's gonna try to go for this pickup. Yes, yeah, she is right there. That's nurses. Okay. I'd like to get them both if I can. Nope, they got up really fast. Wow. Okay, the Fong is dead. Ah, big miss. Damn, they healed her all the way to the all the way to full. All right, let's follow. Terra Radius is back. A lot of progress in that gym. Got to keep that in mind. I think I'm going to go for a mouse one here, if I can. Just kidding. We'll go trail. That's fine. Now, obviously, all my original Rites of Judgment trails have left the uh, environment. Quick and quiet. Very nice. We'll just follow her, though. Get her down here. Let's head into the cage. Alrighty. And let's head back to that gen that's got a lot of progress on it. I definitely think that we need to run Dragon's Grip to try to see if, like, we can, like, camp a gen, I guess, maybe? You could probably do some cool stuff with Shaq. Wait, hold up. Oh, she's right there. Alright, we just, we, just we just sent her to a new one. It was a little bit too close to the cage. It just transferred it over somewhere else. But I guess it's good to get her out of the way. Give him a kiss right now. Big old sword swing there. They're probably healing out of the cage, I would imagine, the two over there. All right, let's stay with him. Looks like he's just holding W. Wow, we almost, we almost lost Jace there. All right, this could be interesting. Let's see. Let's see if we can make, if we can make this work. I mean, maybe a little mind game potentially could have could have made it happen there. Maybe it's like something you could do like kind of on demand, but the terror radius doesn't drop off that that fast. I think like having the red stain be suppressed is probably a cool thing you can do. Being able to being able to do that while you're in an actual chase, which is interesting. All right, what do we got? Jen here. We should probably set up a trail all the way through this area, like so. Let's go for Michaela. She, we know she's right here. She's gonna vault out of this window and imagine. Nope. Ooh, very nice. I think we'll let her go. All right, let's go back to our trail. See if we can catch this Nancy off guard. Let's see. Here we are. All right, these trails are still up in the environment. Nice. Lose the red stain. Cut back. She went all the way to Shaq. Okay. Interesting. The problem with like a structure like this is she can see me, right? She can see me the entire time to Shaq. Actually, that worked out a little bit. All right. We're going to get a little, a little hit here. Looks like you're going to go down. I think she used the rest of her life. So the wizard's over here, too. Good to know. Let's go Let's go for the wizard next. We'll cage her. Let's get her up. I mean, like, it's. I'm on the fence about it. Like, we all know that Pyramid Head's add-ons are really, really bad. Like, this is, like, really bad, it seems. Like, you can like, kind of get some value out of it, unless I'm doing it completely wrong. But nothing like the uh, being undetectable doesn't linger. None of that stuff, right? So, like, if it lingered, I can understand that that wouldn't make sense. Really doesn't. Hold on. She can see me. Let's just stay here. So I can stay mobile, which Insidious doesn't allow us to do. Maybe she thinks I'm gone. I don't think she does. Ah, close. Ooh, very nice life. Right into adrenaline, too. That was actually really good. 
Other thing as well too is I'm, I'm like my I'm so damn big, right? Like I'm so damn big that they could just see me over this kind of stuff. See my big Dorito head at the top of the uh, the top of the tile. All right, we, we should probably be able, should be able to get here. Okay. All right, there's that. Looks like Ace is probably gonna get. Out. I don't think this is. Uh, I don't think you're dead yet, are you? No. Uh, I don't want to cage her because just in case, <laughs> it sends her right over to uh, where the Ace is. They open that door. Good to know. All right, we may be able to do some some cheeky here. Let's see if Ace comes for a save. Let's see. So if Ace goes for the save, looks like he does. Hopefully by the time they come all the way back to this gate, I should be able to get her down. She'll run into my trail. Let's see if we can pull this off. Here she comes. All right, just like that, we're able to get a kill. Center of the cage, nice. <laughs> I mean, like certain things like that, I suppose. You could actually make some fun stuff happen. I think you stayed over here. All right, I don't have any range add-on, so unfortunately, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get to him in time. Uh, we'll see, it's gonna be close. It's gonna dodge one. Oh, unfortunate, my guy. <laughs> you ain't going anywhere, brother. Woo! Well, with the exception of being able to like kind of camp the gate, being undetectable without them knowing, that's really about the extent of what you can really do with the goblet add-on. Um, I really want to try it with Dragon's Grip, though. Let's give that a whirl. All right, so pretty much same build, but this time we added Dragon's Grip and uh, Nowhere to Hide with Pop goes the Weasel. But it kind of like raises the question, like, why wouldn't you just run Trail of Torment? You know what I'm saying? Kind of in there and something like that. Obviously, Trail of Torment goes on cooldown, which is pretty lengthy, right? But aside from that... Set up some trails. Maybe we can like leave these up here in the main section of this of the uh, of this building, and run the goblet down the middle on the off chance that they stay a little bit longer. It's a sprint burst for sure. Yep, yep, yep. All right, let's try this out. I'm gonna go back to this gen, but I'm gonna hide. Right? It's dragon's grip. Nowhere to hide. Let's go like, right over here. See, that's close enough. Ooh. Yep, that's dragon's grip. Okay. I mean, like, I guess that kind of works out. But same thing, you can run that just with Insidious. Um, I guess the only the only benefit of being able to run the trails like that is essentially being able to be mobile for an extent, right? All right, now the trails are still up in the main building, so let's go ahead and try to see if we can be sneaky up here on the off chance that they're here. Ain't okay, no progress. Make our way over here. Like if the add-on, like if the add-on gave you something in terms of like being able to leave that effect and have it linger for a little bit longer, you know what I'm saying? Then that would be okay. All right, he's there. I'm undetectable. Our trail is still up. He should be on his way back over to the gym. He's back on it. There's that one. A lot of distortion users, a lot of distortion gamers today. All right, let's pop that one again. Uh, our trails in the environment in the main section of this place have, uh, are, are gone. I'm gonna set up some more though. Let's take a look over this gen. We saw somebody on this one, so let's head back over here. Give us a kick with Dragon's Grip. Anybody nearby? I don't think so. All right. Nicely done, nicely done. We'll break the pallet. Should get a, should get a hit here for sure. Maybe some, uh, maybe some spicy trails. Yep. There we go. Let's head back to the inside here. A little bit of hit and run stuff. We gotta, we gotta take advantage of this. Just missed him. Damn. Balance landing on Dwight. Boy, the stun. Huge. It's going all the way. We're still undetectable here, all the way to this gen. Nice, nice. I mean, like the problem is, like, you know, I'm so like I'm so easily to see. Hmm. Kinda difficult. 
to get value, to be honest. Jill Sprint burst away. No, this is Dwight. Let's go get Dwight down again. And let's uh, see if we can pop that gin. Right past the uh, right past the ballot. Yeah, so like, another thing as well, too, is like trying to get value out of this stuff, especially like the setup with like Dragon's Grip and shit like that. Like, I I'm committing so much time just to sitting in one area. With like with perks like Trail of Torment, obviously I can I can do other things, right? Like this, like let's see if this even works. Yeah, they just got the save. Is he coming back? Let's see. He was okay. Got a little bit of value out of that, I suppose. No tap on the gin though. We'll send him to the cage. Let's just get him back up and pop that gen again. All right, we know the eight is there. We popped that gen twice so far. Let's head back up top here. Let's set up some trails. Yeah, we even see we even seen this fun once. I mean, one time. Nice hit there. Another hit there. Excellent. Let's go ahead and pop this gen. Uh, let's get it up before Dragon's Grip comes on cooldown. Or comes off cooldown. Let's head back the other way. We use nowhere to hide. See if anyone else is nearby. It didn't look like it. Let's head back over here. All right. So our trails are still up. Let's see if it makes sense. Can we do some? Can we do some cheeky here? Hold on. I'm gonna go back and kick this gen, and apply Dragon's Grip to it, and hide it in my uh, in my trails over here. All right, that's Dragon's Grip on Jeff. All right, we're still undetectable for a little bit longer, so hopefully it's good enough, perhaps. Get him down, nice. And they just finished that gen. So we'll get another fresh pop. Just like that, I mean, you can technically do Trail of Torment Dragon's Grip, or even just simply just going Insidious. Yeah, I don't know. Here we go. Um, I actually want to pop this gen, and we'll leave her, we'll leave her trail for later. All right, so they just finished all the gens. And now I could technically just be a really, really, really campy, I guess. Kind of float, kind of float around this area. Oh, Jeff was right here. Ada's on the other side. Nice. Nicely done. Nicely done. Nicely done. Nicely done. I don't think they have a door open thus far. He fakes this, right? Surely. All right, let's go back this way. We cut back over here. Yeah, there we go. I mean, like, I, it has like it has like some use, I would imagine. I'm trying. Like, I feel like I'm forcing myself. I feel like I'm forcing myself to try to get this to work. To try to like. <laughs> Get some type of mind game off on this guy, but I don't see it happening. Hmm. Super close. All right, let's get him out. Final judgment. The other two should probably leave. Yep, I mean, the verdict's in. He needs, the executioner needs a massive, massive add-on overhaul. Like, being other than being able to do, like, cheeky stuff by, like, hiding actually in a gate or something like that, but in, like, an actual chase, like, you would have to, you would have to trail the entire area like so and kind of just zoom around and, and like just try your best to uh, <laughs> become undetectable but like there's so many other things that you can do that are different trail of torment insidious if you're camping with like dragon's grip stuff like that youtube i try my best add on as we all knew is buns <laughs> it's tough oh boy oh boy